What's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And as you can see today, <coughs> I'm feeling a little sick. <laughs> and we are playing Samurai Siege, guys. This is another episode of Let's Siege. We are working our way up in the game. It's been a lot of fun for me. Um, I've been spending a little bit more time in it in my off time. Um, from work and playing Clash and stuff, and I really, really like it. Um, I'm almost a max castle level 5. Uh, all of my archer towers are up, as you can see, and my cannons are up. For those of you who are new to this game, cannons are like mortars. They do splash damage. Um, my uh, freeze tower is maxed out as well as is my lightning tower, which is sick. The lightning towers do a lot of damage, and they affect a whole lot of troops so they're pretty sweet um, my storages are those max yeah so those are maxed out um, I believe that nope alright so I can upgrade my essence wells um, but other than that I'm getting pretty close to being max I do need to upgrade these two uh, practice shards down here but this one up here is now maxed for my town hall level so we're getting there on this account um, if you guys haven't tried this game out try it out it's been getting really really popular um, in like its first week of release it had a million downloads um, so that's pretty cool I mean imagine releasing a game and having a million people find out about it um, and download it and if you guys haven't checked out the interview with the developers I was able to interview them um, go back a couple videos and watch it it's really really cool um, this game is definitely going to be progressing and um, taking a new path with some of the things that it involves. But hey, why don't we go ahead and jump into the fun part of this and jump into a raid real quick. I'm sorry if I sound sick. I woke up um, and I'm not feeling too good. But hey, we're going to make a video anyways, all right? Um, so we're going to go ahead and battle. And um, I'll let some of you who haven't seen this game uh, see this opening screen. Up at the top is where you choose your single player missions. Um, and then at the bottom is where, right there where it says battle, is where you go to raid. I'm going to break this shield, and I'll be back with you guys in a second once I find an awesome base. Alright, see ya. Alright guys, so I'm going to attack this base, and the main reason is because his freeze and lightning um, things up here are off to the side, and uh, that makes it a little bit easier on me. So the cool thing about this game is uh, one of my favorite troops is a commander, because if you watch... I'll put down some of my samurais and then I'll drop a commander and watch. He's going to command them, see the little green arrows above their heads, um, to go after the archer towers, which is really, really cool. We're going to drop a couple wall breakers, see if we can't um, get our people up inside. So we're going to drop another commander and then he's going to command even more troops to get in there to that cannon. Um, we're going to go ahead and drop some archers out here to take this stuff out. Um, we're going to drop a commander over here and then... Um, some archers there as well to help out with those defenses. I actually am going to see if I can't take out uh, the stuff up here, um, or at least distract with those samurais. Um, maybe drop down one uh, commander up there as well. We can drop down another commander here to help with that archer tower. Um, looks like a lot of our troops down here at the bottom are getting uh, <laughs> wailed on right now. But it looks like we're making our way in pretty good. Um, we can go ahead and drop down the rest of our ninjas down here, which are like goblins in um, Clash of Clans, to get in here and get us some of these resources. As you can see, all these guys with the arrows above their heads are with the commanders. I wish I had one more. Um, what the heck is it called? It's not a wall breaker. <laughs> one more ram. I'm sorry. Still getting used to the terms of this. Um, but there we go. We are breaking in. We are doing good work. Um, we just got the castle right there in the middle. These guys still have the green arrows above their heads even though there aren't any defenses left. But I think that it's really, really cool that there's a troop like the commander in this game who actually tells other troops what to do. Um, I just think that's really awesome. I've never seen that before in a game like this. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, I've really, really enjoyed that and thought that it was awesome. It definitely takes a little bit of getting used to because the commanders definitely aren't tanks. Um, like many people may think they are, they are used to um, help your regular troops uh, focus on defenses. So if you don't want them to focus on defenses, then don't drop the commanders and they'll do whatever, they'll go after whatever they're closest to. If you do want them to, drop a commander and then they'll go after them. I just think that's really cool. 
Um, I've really, really enjoyed that aspect of the game. We just got 100% on this. What's up? Epic victory. 113,000 coins, 179 um, essence. And we found some arm guards, which we will see what we can use for in a second. Um, I don't think I will be able to use them immediately. We'll go down here in a menu and then to loot. And we'll see that the arm guards are under defense right there. So once we get three more things, we will have a free cannon of doom. Once we get two more things um, for the attack, we will have a free army camp. So that'll be awesome. I'm going to go ahead and train up some more troops. I always do three commanders, two wall breakers. And then I fill up the first camp with archers. And then I do three commanders in this one two rams and then I fill it up with the samurai and then I do 15 ninjas but I just upgraded that um, army camp or that practice yard so I'm gonna do 20 of them and then let's get up to 25 on this guy oh no I need to upgrade one of these things I can't go anymore well, that sucks alright but anyways guys looks like that is going to be the end of it can I upgrade one of these I can Let's do it. 16 hours. Yes, please. All right, so that's upgraded. So now we'll actually be able to fill up everything. Um, let's see if I can upgrade anything else. What am I saving my gold for right now? Well, I need to save up for the castle so that I can upgrade it. Um, so I'll save up for that. But I am going to upgrade. Um, I'm going to upgrade one of these essence wells as well. And as you can see, all my carpenters are busy. So we are doing pretty good. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope that y'all are liking this. Um, this doesn't mean I'm stopping Clash, obviously, because I just posted a Clash video. <laughs> so please stop asking. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Man, can you guys send me some medicine or something? Because I'm dying. Um, but that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are awesome. Guys, we just hit, we just freaking hit 8,000 subscribers. And then we're almost up to 8,200 in like one day. Um, so be looking out for that um, for that Q and A video for all of you new subs. That's going to be coming out real soon. Um, go ahead and comment on it if you haven't. And I will talk to you guys soon. All right. Make sure you keep calm and clash on for me. See you guys later.